There's no God that can contest With His royal majesty Complete the final gym that started some months ago Where are yeah. you going? We are going to Canada Of course Wonderful country <laughs> Yes a very exciting country. In fact, Canada has always been a dream country for some of us. So, um, should I say a dream country? Yeah. So, how did this journey start for you? How did this start? How did you okay, so everything began by me scrolling through Instagram. So, yes, guys, Instagram lovers, like to, I would like you to just like this page and all that travels by the daring stories school you never know you may meet uh, some of your dreams come to for you uh -huh. so it happened when i chanced upon your post one of your posts i think it was by a lady uh, who said he, he did pharmacy so and yes that we, she gave quite a good testimony if i remember video I saw vivid because that was my initial encounter with travels by the various and from there and from the way she actually um, recommended um, travels by the various I I thought why not I have a similar goal we are in the same ship together uh -huh. she's a pharmacist I'm also one so I just decided to reach out to you and then so uh, how, how did you contact travels by the Darius? initially I reached out uh, via um, Instagram chat, but he gave me the post that there has to be an initial first encounter, a meeting. That, that, that was supposed to officially introduce myself to the rest of the team. Very, very important. Uh, uh, so that is where they profile you proper. You don't just box everyone into one uh, uh, category, they actually deal with you as an individual. Yes, so you get the opportunity to meet the, the, the team and then you share or you tell them what you want to achieve and then they try and then help you with the wealth of expertise that you have. So talking about health, what health exactly have you got to do with Travis Bay? Chale, I'm at Kotokai International Health and I wouldn't have been here without Travis Bay. So they have really helped. They have guided me. Um, they gave me sound advice some immigration advice um, they actually took care of should i say from a to z um, the processes involved one in applying to the school um, they took care of all those stuff um, they of course i was in the know every every stage of the process they told me where they have gotten to okay it's not that they do everything and then you don't know what they are doing in the, in the dark. No, they let you know exactly what they do. They even show you the receipts. I was surprised when he even show you the receipts of the application fee he, he paid when he applied for me at the university. Yeah, so it shows some form of transparency. Yes, these guys are very legit guys. So I would encourage everyone to try them and then taste some of these goodies. Before, before this, have you have you tried um, this traveling thing before? Yes, I have. Yes, I have. On my own, you know, I have. When I completed, I really wanted to uh, do something extra because I felt I had a lot of things to give as far as humanity was concerned. So I wanted to advance. So I applied on my own, and then uh, a few things, a few applications went through, and then, but I wasn't getting what I really wanted. I wasn't getting the scholarships I wanted, so I wanted I wanted someone who could guide me. You understand? Yes, I wanted someone who has tried, or who is a tried and tested person who knows the system better. So sometimes if you think you know everything on your own, you will probably not um, go far. So that was where uh, Derek came. He was like a guide. He guides and then he leads. He advises. And then he leaves the final decision. Hopefully, set to travels by the Derek. Thank you very much, uh, Derek. Um, he's a man of few words. Usually, when you're chatting with him, he's just straight to the point. He doesn't. He cuts to the chase, as we normally say. He doesn't waste time on words. Okay. Uh -huh. He likes to get the job done. He doesn't like just 
uh, unnecessary chats or something like that. But that is not to say he's not an affable person or a friendly person. He is very, very friendly. Yes, we crack jokes when you call and all that. But he's that type who takes his work serious. And I really admire all the efforts the whole team has put in my uh, dream and to actually travel to Canada to pursue this graduate. Uh, so quickly, so to those watching, um, yeah, so to those watching, yeah, our team maybe this is, is not what do you have to tell them? Yeah, this is not a shout, this is real, okay, this is real. Um, if you have any immigration dream, okay, be it traveling to study, um, be it uh, work, uh, let's, you want to work, work abroad, anything that has got to do with immigration, I would always recommend some of they are the best in town currently. Trust me. Yeah, I know what I mean. So please just contact them, reach out to them, and then enjoy yourself. So what will be the first thing you do when you get to Canada? Come again. What will be the first thing you do when you get to Canada? Um I'll probably take a pen and then write the name Canada in my diary and then date it uh, for future <laughs> references. Thank you so much. All right, thank you. All right, all right. All right. But welcome, yeah. welcome nice. to St. John's. I mean, welcome to Canada. How do you find the place? The place, the place looks good. It's good, it's eh? Cold up. It looks good. Oh, okay. How was your flight? Yeah, my flight was okay. Except like it got, it got delayed. Except yes, it, got it got delayed. delayed I mean, slightly. yeah, yeah. It it kind of, kind of happens. But like, I mean, no. Yeah, sure. It's excited. Oh, yeah. You're excited very, very to be excited. here, isn't it? Very, very yeah. excited. How do you find it? Beautiful place, isn't it? Of course, very exactly. beautiful. Well organized. Yeah, right. Uh, yeah, just great. Yeah. 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 And I was here on time, isn't it? Yes. I was 